yeah. Now we're gonna go into the next set of the game. Next set with DJ Sir and Heisen. Also, there is a five battle pass giveaway on Twitter. Make sure if you miss out the Discord, five battle passes, something, whatever. You're more active on Twitter, go go on there. Uh, into the game we go. Small Brawl Haven, Heisen versus DJ Sir over on the winner's side. Winner's final. Who's gonna take it? We've seen DJ Sir 3 2 uh, Machete, but it was not just any 3 2, it was a reverse. He won three in a row, and we see Heisen with the 3 0 against Acto fighting up against each other with the axe mirror here Reggie I don't I don't know who's gonna I don't know who's gonna take this one I don't know it's it's pretty fun to see axe versus axe especially because it's such a powerful weapon does so much damage but Heisen offs the switch for hammer so we'll see Ooh. if that was worth it Jester does stick up with a weapon throw picks up a lance and gets that first stock against Heisen which is pretty big right off the bat the Jester is in the lead with the axe. But hammer. Oh, I thought it was gonna be hammer, but Heisen, I guess, on the axe mirror. Ew, the weapon throw almost hits there, but doesn't quite do the job. Both characters here do a ton of damage, but Taros just doing his work there. D-Light Slider gets the first stock. And uh yeah, who do you think's gonna win this, Veggie? Predictions, predictions. Uh mm -hmm. honestly, I don't know. I'm I'm you know. I'm gonna go with Heisen just because T Taros is so much fun. Honestly, if he sticks with Taros, I'm, I'm gonna be rooting for him just because why not? Oh my goodness. Yeah, and just the Lance bias, man. No one likes Lance, so. Yeah, yeah, maybe <laughs> that's why. <laughs> I'm that kidding. could be why. <laughs> I'm Heisen? not. Heisen? Okay. <laughs> Heisen with the hammer here against DJ Sir's Lance. They've swapped off their respective axe weapons the axe mirror and they are showcasing their secondaries there heisen tries to go for that d light off stage but doesn't quite connect it heisen on the axe back to the mirror between the two of them they're both and red dj with the gc sidelight unarmed gets that stock and it's uh, i don't know i still think that heisen can get this stock pretty quick uh especially on taros yeah definitely very big for d Jester getting that stock in but heisen is like nah we're, we're yeah. gonna even this out we're gonna even this out so right now it is one one at this point could go either way heisen taking that advantage when d Jester didn't have a weapon and going pretty crazy with the axe but d Jester is pretty different with the lance i must say yeah he's hitting a lot of these attacks on the lance and he's getting great follow-ups misses that read up but oh beautiful punish off that side signature and the weapon throw with the lance dj sir is oh my god oh no oh no it was going so well <laughs> wow uh, how the wow. tables have turned how the how, turns have tabled. how the turns have tabled wow look at that amazing. you know what's That's... incredible is that yeah heisen did less damage than what he got but he still managed to win which is pretty yeah. incredible i think that's the first time we've seen that in he this... mind gamed him yeah that, just... that definitely mind games there <laughs> yeah. because, wow he manages that to get that win look at that punish that was incredible yeah very well played from heisen to capitalize and punish Three, that two, off stage one, play from dj sir he was popping off like don't get me wrong dj sir was doing great work on the lance off stage getting those weapon throws getting those uh down airs but heisen capitalized it with that weapon throw and the ground pound on the x was just enough to get that uh first game of the set so heisen in the lead for the set on the winners final here dj sir on the lance ticket to it as well i don't know we're i'm sure we'll see another axe v axe mirror but right now dj sir is putting a lot of work with that lance mm -hmm. definitely doing something there with the lance you know it's interesting to see that they chose miami dome as the map because it is a platform map which is mm -hmm. something we don't see so often in these sets so i wonder how they're gonna play around with that a little bit yeah we've seen a lot of the small brawl haven uh for some reason but yeah, we will see a lot more of these axe play. Oh, but the Jester almost gets taken out. He, I think. He, oh, no. is that it? Oh, he. Oh my God. Opted he made it to back. go the other way, but he still made it back. That was interesting. He's a gamer. See. He is a gamer. Yeah. Heisen trying to play is a little bit more to... safe. Yeah, me, maybe maybe that's what it is. But Heisen is trying to get that stage control against the Jester. But see, that's what you, that's what you see when there is a platform oh. map. You know, he is able to go back onto stage. There is an advantage there, but Heisen yeah. 
Just trying to get that first stock <laughs> in, but Digester is not giving up. Beautiful side air on Heisen on the hammer. And with the platforms like you're talking about, they can really, like, if someone's aerial, they can, like, neutral air. They can do whatever under the platform, but... But yeah, oh, nice dodge from DJS there. Heisen and DJS there have switched sides here and, like, takes him out. And that was only the first stock. Very long stock uh, to yeah. be taken there, I would say, um, mm -hmm. in game two, but I don't know. Yeah, definitely was... Took, it took a bit longer than I was expecting, but uh, right now, DJS does have... I, I was about to say that he still has a stock, but mm, yeah, now yeah. he does it. Right now, we are much more. more even. Digester doesn't have a weapon. Heisen is holding him with that axe and seeing what he could do with it. Still pretty even right now. Pretty even. We see the axe spear coming from both players. Again, Heisen in the lead of the set could potentially bring up a bigger lead here with the 2 uh, or DJ so can even it out here just depends on what happens in this stock here side signature misses Heisen going for the end line down there missing a recovery connects a lot of these axe damage is stacking on either side but Heisen taking more of the brute end of it mm -hmm. definitely holding a bit more damage but still pretty even somewhat but the just is trying to get some of that to change with the lance. Heisen opting to switch for hammer right now. Yeah, this it. the lance is so good in DJSer's hands, but he throws it away for the axe, knowing that he could potentially get this kill. I, I he's gonna down take it. I believe, I believe. Never mind. Oh wait, interesting. The hammer hits down there. Oh, oh the side oh. thing. No punish from Heisen. Oh, that is unfortunate. Heisen wasn't me able to make it back onto stage, but it was looking like he had a good chance there. I don't know what happened, but Digester does still have his second stock. It's pretty low, it though. It was close. It was definitely close. Digester trying to come back to stage with the Lance. Holds that stock lead, but gets taken out quickly. It's a fresh stock. One and one for both players here. It's anybody's game in the game two of the set. Heisen holding the weapon lead, but he's got the axe. The Jester is, is, I don't know, his, his lance is very scary. Mm -hmm, definitely. It's something else right now. Heisen has to get some damage in. Otherwise, I don't know what's going to happen with the Jester's lance right now. It is very even, so it could go either way right now. He just might want to get this stock pretty fast so he can Ooh. even out the set. And oh it's my looking God, pretty, the it's looking pretty good for Heisen though. Right now he does pick up the axe. The Jester is weaponless. Quickly manages to get an axe right back. And it's axe, versus, it's axe versus axe right now. It's dangerous. Off stage. This happened last game. Off stage was not very good for DGS with the axe there at Heisen is taking a lot more damage than he wants to. He's trying to get this elimination on a hammer, but I don't know if it's gonna happen. A side signature oh. takes the stock. Oh, yes, just like you said, it was wow. very close there. Wow, I thought Heisen was gonna take that one, but yeah, unfortunately did not. Mm -hmm. Heisen was in the lead there, but look at that. The Jester managed to take the win. Seeing that they didn't have that much difference in damage, the Jester had a little bit more, but he managed to take the win there, which is very interesting to see. Look how much damage that he did with the axe as opposed to Lance, which is very interesting to see. And Heisen barely touched his hammer in comparison to his axe, which is also interesting. Yeah, very interesting to see. Acno, or no, sorry, Heisen and <laughs> Tijesser is going on to Demon Island here, Three, and it is 1-1. One, one. One. Uh, in the set, Heisen could have made it a 2-0, but I uh, didn't, you know, DJ came out on top in the last one. Uh, but the Axe play, there's a lot of Axe plays here in this uh, in this matchup for sure for both of them. Mm -hmm. Definitely a lot of Axe plays happening, as you said, but Heisen is working the hammer right now. So maybe that'll change things up a bit. Yeah, D-Light into the side air. DJS are trying to get this uh, elimination on Heisen pretty quick. But uh, he's not. These weapon throw down. He's, uh, he's playing mind games. He's, uh, he's trying, to, trying to fake him out. Definitely. Maybe maybe some mind games like you said. But <laughs> DJS is holding on with the Lance right now. Heisen does get that first stock against him. 
holding a bit of a lead right now, but still pretty damaged. Very damaged. Tyson is three stocks, like you said. Ooh, beautiful side air gets that stock as well. It's just, yeah, it's just Axe v. Axe here, but DJ Esser sprinkling, sprinkling in a little bit of Lance every now and then, you know, but it does well. The, the Lance on him is uh, is very formidable. Mm -hmm. It definitely is right now. DJ Esser is trying to get stuff happening with this Axe. It's so interesting. I find it really fun to see when they near each other. Oh my weapons. God. I'm sorry, I just hear so much down there. It's like, there's so, they're just swinging. There's just a ton of things swinging. A, lo a lot of things swinging, but Heisen opts to go for the hammer. Jester's trying to take something out here, but Heisen holding the lead right now in terms of damage, both even with stocks right now. Heisen, is that enough to get a kill against the Jester? No, he manages to make it back onto stage to try to change things up a bit. Yeah, another axe mirror here from both players. DJ Esser gets taken out. Heisen in the lead again. So I know he's got to put some more work in. DJ Esser is uh, is looking pretty, pretty not good here. Pretty, pretty not good indeed. I would say. Yeah, very not. No bueno. Very. But now bueno. Very, very good. Not, very not. Yes. Very good. Not good. <laughs> 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 Definitely. Right now, it is even with the stocks. So we'll see what happens. Right now, Digester does have his lance, his trusty lance, while Heisen is still opting for the axe. Oh yeah. He favors that axe a lot over that over that hammer for sure. Mm -hmm. Definitely. But you know what? It works for him. And why not it stick does. with what works for you? All right now, Heisen and is a little bit more damaged than Digester, so we'll see if. He can make a comeback right now. We'll see if he can make a comeback. But I don't know. Heisen was in the lead. Dejester was the one that made the comeback. And he's doing great with it. Beautiful read on Heisen. Beautiful neutral area there as well. Damage is even across the board. And that will do it. Potentially. Oh, it's up to Heisen. Will it? Is it oh. enough? Oh, no. Dejester made it back onto stage. You got to eat your words there. Because right yeah. now... Ah! Right now, it's a switch right now. It was looking pretty favorable for Heisen until things switched nice. up. Nice. And it is good. Heisen does get that final blow against Digester and takes the win. He takes the win indeed. But uh, yeah, he's still 2-1. Uh, you know, if, it, if the pattern continues, maybe, but, uh, maybe uh, Heisen will... Uh, Get to uh, game three there and move on into the bracket. But uh, overall, you can't count out um, either player. DJ Esser is is still playing very well. It's very close every time. So. Mm -hmm. Definitely, if you look at the damage, it's always pretty even somewhat. They do both a considerable amount of damage. Both of them mostly working on the axe, getting, getting their damage in there. Not really using their secondary weapon as much, but still somewhat using it, and they're doing crazy things with it. So yeah, the damage is pretty close, like you said, both in the, or around the 600 range uh, from both players there. Even, but you know, the axe was way more favored. But uh, you know, DGS or split is a lot more, uh, a lot more even there. But Three, two, both characters one, are the same on either side. Um, DJ Sir might be able to pull this to a game five, but I don't know. Heisen has been popping off, getting more of those secure. Uh, knockouts with the axe and uh yeah let's see what he does on the hammer yeah we're gonna see if this is something he can do to finalize the set right now because digester does need this game if he doesn't it's over for him so i mean not over over he'll be able to go to the losers bracket but he he wants to win this you, you gotta you gotta try winning this so oh yeah Heisen definitely is going to be trying to get that final game in here for him. We'll see if he can manage to pull that off. For sure. DJ Esser on Demon Island again against Heisen. More damage stacked on Heisen a little bit more than than, than the Lance player here. Oh, beautiful weapon throw. Can we get a knockout here? But no, Heisen gets that side air. And uh, it's, it's actually good to see more of the hammer coming out from Heisen evening out more of the work actually he's favoring the hammer here Let's see what he does can he can he deny entry back on stage cannot dj Esser back makes it back on stage tyson trying to hold that control on demon island and he does very well with the down air to get that first stock in game four mm -hmm. right now 
The Jester needs to get that stock against him to even this out pretty quickly. But Heisen's not giving up. He still has his axe and he's ready to get some hits in. At least before any kind of... Wow. Well, I'm gonna well, eat my words again. <laughs> yeah, beautiful. Heisen, Heisen loses his first stock right now. It evens out again. We'll see what happens right now because the Jester is going pretty crazy with the axe. Yeah, it's going pretty crazy. Heisen doing a lot more work with the hammer in this game, surprisingly, because he's been really favoring the axe. Maybe he's recognized he's a lot more stronger against DJS or, or DJS's playstyle with the hammer, but I'm not I'm not too sure. Heisen trying to get this uh, knockout quickly on DJS before uh, anything else can happen. But I don't know, Veggie. It's kind of hard to say. Heisen's popping off though. Heisen is definitely he's doing work he is doing work and it is and it is going well for him right now he is potentially able to get the second stock off of the jester pretty soon if this works out for him but the jester's not giving up so we're gonna see if he can make a comeback here with his lance this is true the lance is popping off a beautiful dash down into the down air gets that first or gets that second off djs there and heisen in the lead of the set could potentially close this out and send djs there into the losers final here but uh i'm sure he'll hold on he djs has come back many times here especially with this old rim and uh let's see what happens again on the hammer yeah right now it's looking pretty fortunate for heisen he does have the hammer with him. He's ready to get that final stock against the Jester, but the Jester's not giving up. He's going pretty crazy with the hammer right now. So maybe that's his weapon of choice here instead of the axe. Yeah, beautiful down air. Again, a lot of these down airs connecting from Heisen on the hammer. And again, like he is favoring hammer this game more so any other uh, matchup against the Jester. And it's doing really, really well. Like he's up a whole stock. He's in the Jester's in red but he's not he's not giving in DJs are on the lance unarmed heisen is kind of trying to i don't know he's, he's getting pushed to uh to his limit for sure from DJs. Mm -hmm, definitely DJs manages to get that second stock off him but it's still not looking so good for him he really needs to get some damage in against heisen if he wants to keep this set going yeah and i don't know something could happen off stage it, it, anything can happen against these players so we gotta watch out for that but heisen is in the lead um without a doubt in this uh in this game and that takes the stock heisen moves on over to the grand finals to sit there comfortably waiting for the loser side to finish off congratulations to him and uh, well played from dgs they're almost making the comeback there um yeah wow that was very fortunate for heisen he got a, a quite a bit more damage in this game to finish off the set which is really big for him opting for the hammer as we can see as opposed to axe like the previous games in the set and it mm -hmm. worked out for him it was a really good choice on his end and he won from that so yeah yeah he, he like on the stats that show you know hammer was played a lot more got a lot more damage from the taros there and maybe that switch up was uh what was needed uh like you said against uh against djs there but, you know, he's not out. Dejaster is in the loser side of the bracket and will be up against the winner of the next set that we're going to be streaming and casting uh, Machete and Akno uh, moving forward. But again, don't forget, guys, we're doing five Battle Pass giveaways in Discord and on Twitter at the Lost Tribe account. And uh, we're doing some code drops in the Twitch chat as well and some trivias for fun as well. So make sure you guys take advantage of all the uh all the different rewards out there and uh i want to thank you guys again for watching this uh event that we are hosting for you guys and yeah thank you guys for watching and of course as a way of appreciating you we do have a battle pass giveaway happening right now in the discord OMG, so it OMG. is it is live if you guys want to join in for that we already gave away two battle passes our second battle pass winner was legendary gamer so congrats on that one right there and we are this is our third battle pass that we are giving away in the discord so if you want to win that enter right now join the discord go to the lost kingdom info channel it is at the top of the discord so it's hard to do miss it. yeah do it if you have any questions please dm a moderator or a staff member um in the stream and or in the discord i'm sure they'll get back to you pretty quick 
but uh but yeah uh super exciting to see all the players play today thank you guys all that turned out and played the events as well participated um whatever it is i appreciate you guys and uh we're moving on over to our first game of the losers uh final here with uh, our loser semi-final with machete and acto so, again on demon island veggie machete on the uh magyar consistent throughout the entire tournament acto actually switching it up studying what he did last time against machete um wait did acto and machete play actually no acto did not play machete. well acto playing the a brand new character here that we've seen uh the azov yeah it's, it's cool to see how he switched things up a bit um Agno has switched things up before in previous sets, but um, Machete, as you said, has kept it pretty consistent here with the Great Sword, and it works out for him. So we'll see what happens here. Right now, Machete is taking more damage, and Agno gets that first stock off of him, not even taking that much damage right away. So that's pretty good for him. Yeah, it is pretty interesting. Agno getting that first stock off of machete machete's been dominating i feel like with that hammer uh well, on the magic especially the greatsword as well very consistent on both weapons here on either player or either side um so yeah very interesting i know actually doing so well with azov right now mm -hmm. definitely putting in the work and it is paying off right now Agno still has his third stock We'll see how long that lasts because Machete does pretty well when, once he has a, his greatsword. Right now he's opting for the hammer though. Yeah, opting for the hammer. It is doing pretty good, but not good enough. Akno is in the lead here. Gets the... Oh, doesn't get the knockout quite yet. Akno on the bow. Beautiful weapon throw, but it's taken out with a neutral air. Machete going for that weapon starf and actually holding the greatsword. So we'll see what happens here. Yeah, right now Machete is doing what he does best with his great sword, and we'll see if it can combat Akno's axe plays. Though it's interesting to see the Azov pick; it's pretty fun. I, I actually really like that pick. So right now we have Machete holding the the ground right now with the great sword, opting to pick up the hammer, and pretty much evening out the damage right now.